Welcome to Tech Brothers with Dharma. In this video, we are going to learn about doc string that can be used in Kusto. Doc string is a free text that you can attach to a function, to a table, or a column describing the entity. This string is presented in various UX settings next to the entity name. I don't have really a way to show you how this will be presented or how this can be helpful because there could be some scenarios where they can be in the different application. This can be useful and people can see the detailed message to it but what we are going to do we are going to go ahead and uh, see how you can add to it uh, so in case uh, you have uh, some requirement uh, you can work on it uh. so here i am uh, and uh, right now i'm in my uh, database tech browser db and uh, what we have here we have uh, this table called the my table if i would like to add a doc string with it uh, what i have to do i have to say dot alter table and then actual table name in my case is my table name my table and then I will say doc string. After doc string, I can provide information, whatever I would like to display. This is a customer table. So that's what I just provided it here. And then I can simply execute. Once I execute, you are going to see right there, it has some information right there. Okay. So if you click right there, you can, you will see this information has been added. Okay. Let's see right there. See doc string. Now, if uh, we would like to do the same thing for the columns, uh, in uh, here I have in my table, uh, I have name and I have address and phone number. So let's say if I would like to add some uh, doc string uh, with the, for the name or for the address column, I can do that as well. So in this case, I use uh, alt merge. So alter merge in the last videos, you guys know that this is pretty much same uh, like alter table. So alter merge, then you have say table, and the actual table name so in my case it's my table and then you have to say column doc strings so once you do that after that you have a small parenthesis here then the name of the column in this case we have a column name um, that as name and then i provide the information right there that i would like to display as a doc string so this is a uh, this is full name for customer and then i have address column right here and then i provide the customer address so wherever in the ux uh, uh, if this uh, information can be displayed uh, this will be very helpful uh, so you can just simply go ahead and execute this guy right there and that's it that's all you have to do and uh, this this is pretty much this was a quick and uh, short uh, video thanks for watching and uh, subscribe my channel if you guys like my video and i will see you guys uh, in next video